Hi, my name is Chris Perales, Senior Manager for Technical Product Marketing on the Blackboard Learn team, and welcome to another quick hit video. Today, we're going to talk about a couple of administrator-focused features that help boost your efficiency when diagnosing and troubleshooting your Learn servers. The Admin Console Building Block streamlines the process for gathering system information directly from Learn's user interface. It provides access to critical server information on local and remote servers via a Learn Administrator account reducing, and in many cases eliminating, the need for command line access. This release of the Admin Console delivers over 40 improvements and enhancements that improve performance, improve the user interface experience through enhanced data visualization, and through the addition of historical data and system performance data, improve the ability to trend system performance over time, enabling more comprehensive analysis of system performance and issue diagnosis. The newly released Redis Cache building block when paired with the Admin Console, offers self-hosted system administrators a new way to manage and monitor the performance of their Learn instances. The building block provides improvements in system performance, scalability, and availability by providing an additional type of memory storage outside of the Java Virtual Machine heap. Without the Admin Console, access to the level of information provided by the Admin Console requires significant system knowledge and access to the command line and, in many cases, institutional policy limits the number of individuals who have access to the command line, disrupting the ability for system administrators and support to monitor and triage system operations. So try out the Admin Console today, and for you self-hosted clients, make sure to download the Redis Cache building block as well. That does it for me in another Quick Hit video. Make sure to check out the Blackboard TV YouTube channel for more Quick Hit videos, and don't forget to follow me on Twitter at ArtfulPresenter. Thanks a lot, and I'll talk to you soon.